hello guys i will be so this is my project for object recognition uh, i am using artificial neural net for the classification and gab uh, gabber filter for the filtering i will show you the data what i have so i am using uh, for now for the example i am using apple and banana to differentiate this one so i am using six photos with a white background these are the apple and images of a banana so what I am doing, I am adding all the feature, uh, applying Gabber filter first. This is the code. And this is on the, uh, for now I am applying only for banana. As we run the photo, we will see two different features. This are the magnitude and this is the face of the image. Once we get the image, now I will apply the normalization on that one. So what we will be doing, we will be applying standard deviation on that one. So for that one, I'm using the function std. Once we apply that on the result, what we get from the gamble, we will get this release, like you can see. So I have created a bank for that one. So this is for the banana, 0.1253 for the magnitude and the face. This is for the apple, 0.3. So as we know, we have six images. So total, we will get 12 data. Once we get the normalization, now we will run the neural network and train it. So as you can see, I am using three hidden ne uh, neurons and two inputs. In the iteration is 10,000. As you can see, that's the, uh, this is the same value what we have used. This is the label data. So for now, I am using one as the banana and zero as the apple. Once we run this thing, as we know, renal data will take some time for the training. So right now what we are doing, we are training it for the 10,000 iteration. Uh, we have three hidden neurons. And uh, as we complete this one, I will show you what are the trained hidden neurons that we will be getting. Uh, what, as it is a 10,000, it will take some time. Uh, the image what we have taken is of a particular size of 650 by 650. This graph will show us the cost function was the error graph. So it's, it is done. So let's see. This is the error. As you can see, after the thousand itself, we are getting pretty much optimum result. Uh, still, uh, we are running up to 10,000. So now it is trained. Let's see. Uh, what are the hidden weights of the hidden neurons? Let me stretch this guy. Sorry, I don't know. Uh, two hands with a single hand, it's difficult. Yeah, so now we can see. So, this is the um, weights of the hidden neuron for the input uh, hidden there, and this is for the input 3 cross 3 and 1 cross 3. Once we're done with this thing, so now a neural network has been trained. Now the path is to for test it. So now we will move in for the testing. So as we run this guy, now it is asking for the normalization value. So this is the value as we know from the bank. This is value of the banana. So if we put this guy. Just a minute. Oh, I have to change the. So here I have used banana and apple to just to display the result. That's why it's saying it's error. Let me run it again, and it's asking for the normalization value. I am putting this thing. So as you can see, it's showing. Yeah, it's a banana. But let's see for the apple. If if I run it again, and if we put the value different, which is 0.33.276 which as you can see this guy this is of the apple band this is standard uh, deviation value of the gabber filter result as we enter this guy we can see okay this apple so this is uh, how i have done this is my single semester project object recognition with gabber filter normalizing uh, normalizing it using standard deviation as a preprocessor to feed into artificial neural network Thank you.